Hello Virgo, how's it going? I just went ahead and shuffled your deck. I am going to be doing a Who is Coming Towards You February reading. So let's get started. We have the Two of Pentacles, the Knight of Wands, ooh, the Empress. You could be feeling yourself, Virgo. Um, Virgo, you have two cards here that indicate fire energy. The Empress represents Aries. And the Knight of Wands also represents fire, could be Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius. What I like about your reading so far is the Empress is someone who is very um, self-aware, someone who's very creative, abundant, um, someone who, you know, cares for others. This person just is a very healing, nurturing person in general. Um, the Knight of Wands, I like it also because you have someone here moving towards you, could be quite excited um, to make things happen, could be a new start. This person has a lot of, just a lot of fire, a lot of gusto, a lot of, um, like, just joy, free-spirited kind of person. They, they light up a room. Um, with the Two of Pentacles showing up here, you could also have two choices, um, between people, um, many options. I'm going to pull a clarifying card for that. Alright, I have sword energy popping out. So you could have an air sign who is very excited to move forward, forward with you, but what's interesting so you have the the ace of swords so that's you know mental clarity new ideas could be you know a new love interest like i said could be air energy aquarius um gemini libra but the two cards that i'm focused on that popped out before that were the five of pentacles and then eight of swords these are quite sad cards this person could have a lot of um hurt in their past so they could have felt you know left out in the cold um could have felt a little bit mentally like imprisoned and just not feel like they have been treated right in the past so the person moving towards you could be air um they could be quite logical in nature and i think you kind of like that virgo because i the virgos that i've known um they tend to also be thinkers as well and with the sword energy i think that this person sometimes uses their their head over their heart um, so a good way to maybe get to know this person is to, you know, be pretty straightforward and kind of use that logical nature of yours to find out more about them. So I think that you have someone here who, again, had that past energy of, it was a complicated, it was a complicated past, um, but they're ready for that new beginning is what I'm feeling from this card. Like, they're ready to just, you know, start a new cycle, close that chapter of their life, and move forward. And, like I said, you could have two choices here um, between someone who, you know, is a little bit more logical, um, maybe straightforward about how they interact with others, and then you also have the maybe more uh, fiery, passionate, um, kind of less... I want to say logical, um, but very entertaining and quite warm um, in personality, uh, fire sign coming towards you. So that could be Aries, Sagittarius, or Leo. But like I said, you're sitting pretty right here with the like, Two of Pentacles. Um, looks like you have a couple of options. Just make sure that when you are deciding um, that you don't, you know, um, rule out your gut feeling. I'm going to pull out one more card for you. Um, okay, so this is interesting. I'm really glad that I pulled out a clarifying card here for the Two of Pentacles. Your, your, uh, Empress card has the Emperor, so it might be, it might be telling you to maybe lean more towards the, the fire sign, again, because you could be showing up as the Emperor. That is the card of Aries, like I said, um, but that's a happy union, is what I'm feeling between you and and the fire sign. Um, but again, it is your choice. It is up to you to make that decision. Um, but you, you have choices, Virgo. So you're sitting pretty. And yeah, I hope that resonated. And that is all I have for you this time. I will see you next time.